Stewart looking to throw for the second straight play, and he's got team 30s. They had not won a conference title before this year in 43 years. There's a nice delivery. First and 10 for BYU outside of their own 35. Throws, and he's got map two for the Cougars. Already down in this game. The play fake and wide open. Mid so first and 10, BYU across midfield for the first time. Another play fake. And Stewart under duress throws wide open. Mitchell Jurgens. Touchdown, BYU. Well, Stewart from the shotgun and another catch. That tackles for a loss. He's a guy that can wreak some havoc, too. Second and two. Stewart throws and Jurgens with the catch in traffic. And then he breaks a tackle. Jurgens across mid. Defender. So without Jurgens to catch it and make move upfield. Hey, they are going to actually run the ball every <laughs> once in a while. Algie Brown with the carry. And you do both functions. So you can start to talk a little bit more. Uh, Brown with the carry, and he pow. About halfway through the first quarter. Stewart is going to hit Matthews way behind the line of scrimmage, and he can. Talking before this game, he's got five catches <laughs> already in the first quarter. Stewart in the pocket, throwing deep. Matthews is wide open after the defense. Plenty of time on the play clock. Stewart. From the end zone. Will throw, and he's got his man caught for a first. Stewart, I think that's a backwards pass. Mitchell Jurgens goes forwards. How can motion two big receivers on the left side? Stewart on third down, pressured and throws. He's got Matthews who hangs on. Christian Stewart with the play fake. And he'll hit Jurgens, who gets hit himself. Very warm day here. That's a good point. I'm glad you bring that up. <laughs> now, it should be noted that Danny and I are also on the Memphis side. Blue. Now, maybe the most important point for BYU, the play was a first down, so it's first and 10, even though they lose that 15 yards of field position. A nice little pass. Out. Not just Taysom Hill. Stewart with time throws middle. With the positions they play. Oh, BYU's offense on the move. Stewart will dump it short in this game. More than four minutes for the Cougars with the ball. Jurgens going for it on fourth and three. Big play for the BYU offense. Stewart will throw toward the end zone. And Wesley! Memphis thinks they both could be very good. Play fake. Lynch. And it's intercepted. Now there is a flag down on the play. Alani Fua returning it along the sideline, jumping up over tacklers. I think that's a huge BYU break. I, I don't think that should have been pass interference. Well, it's it to himself. I think that should have been called. Lasique off the pitch. Paul Lasique. And Dowdy. See where, see where their broadcast booth yeah, is. <laughs> that's right. The Bahamas. Here's Algie Brown, who has been seven touchdowns accounted for. He's done that a couple times in his career. He's going to shatter some records if he stays healthy. I mean, you're looking at the guys. Paxton Lynch and company. Memphis offense back on the field. Kind of heaves oh. that one up. A bad decision and an interception. Position. Yeah. by 10. We'll see if they can take advantage of it. More pressure on Stewart, who throws. And what a catch. By the tight end, Mahina. Motion for BYU's offense. Great field position for a second time in a row. Stewart, though, under pressure, finds his man. Exactly where they stalled before. Exact same spot. Lasique, tough running. Lasique! That pass is caught. First down. Stewart, very positive, very vocal. Now on the sidelines, the message is keep fighting. We've got them where we want them. Hine, screen pass. Second and eight for Memphis. Memphis can time number 40. And an interception. They were trying for the tight end. It's a BYU touch. Nose. Well, Stewart is throwing the ball. It's caught. What a catch by Matt. With time to throw over the middle. Intercepted. 